Okay. Bobby, we always need an intro for videos. Oh, shoot it real quick. He, oh, we are shooting. Yeah, it, it's Friday, so of course he's like, hey, go to the truck. So he uploads the video without an intro. You don't want to know how my cars are going to take care of tomorrow. Oh, well, here we go. Let's, but let's let's do the intro for this video. Willow's going to be good. This is, what's his name again? Jack. It's Jack 64. Oh, and we're going to go with Jack's, yeah. Jack's 1964 and a half convertible guys we'll do a quick appraisal on it. We're going to be uh, writing it up on Monday, but we did a video while we looked at it. I got a lot of still pictures. I'm not putting them up. It's part of the appraisal. And again, oh, footage too. yeah, I'm not, I'm not a licensed, I'm not a licensed appraiser, but we can do opinions from our business of what something's worth and that has value. So here's Jack's 1964 and a half 260 generator Mustang convertible. Taking a quick look at it. And then we got a surprise at the end. Check it out. <laughs> I just uh, the fact that they might want to sell it, but now it's not a surprise because it's on the intro. Thanks, Bobby. Looks nice and straight. You can see the lines are no bad gaps that I can see. Glass lines up. Means there's no issue with the pillar. Doors look good. Rust in the doors again. Rust in the quarters is going to have to be dealt with. And rust in the quarters right there. But I don't see any rust in the floor pans, which basically means that most likely there wasn't any real leaking going on through the top or the glass. Just typical water getting plugged in areas that it can't escape. Overall, a, uh, a very clean 260 that uh, just needs a lot of love, restoration style, but a very rare car, and the first of her breed, 64 and a half convertible. All right, champ. All right, guys, the metal looks good on this. I'm, I'm quite pleased to see a 64 that looks so clean. The doors are showing rust through here, but if you bring her over, Cliff, bring under here and show under here, you'll see the drain plugs are pretty clean. They're not showing rust, can you see it? On video, see the drains on the bottom. It's a DSO of 41, which means it's not a California car, but it's surprisingly rust free. So I'm very pleased to report that. Follow me, Cliff, jump up. Yes, sir. We've taken the seat. You can, you can be in the videos, Mr. Rob, uh, Rob uh, fix, fix it all, fix it all, girl. <laughs> the seats, um, they have covers on them. We took the covers off, get over here and look at these seats. They're kind of, they're, look like they're original seats. There's a tear in here, but for the most part, it, it's pretty supple. It's surprisingly in good shape. Red interior, uh, red exterior. We can check to see what the original color is supposed to be on it. We got a little bit of rust here. We got missing snaps here. Um, if you come around here, but we 